Hey guys, it's Cora Ross and welcome to this video about Rainbow Six Siege Vanilla Mode. So what you're watching here is one of my earliest Rainbow Six Siege videos and you can see how I'm able to get all these stupidly easy kills and it's because the game has just been launched and this is it back at the original release of Rainbow Six Siege. People are still very much getting used to the game. At this point, I'd been playing the beta, so I wasn't the worst player when I, when it launched. And uh, you can see a lot of easy kills that I'm getting. But this is what a vanilla version of the game would be. And a lot of people are asking, what is a vanilla version? So vanilla will be going right back to the release of Rainbow Six Siege. So it would basically look just like this with the old HUD elements, the old details, and... You know, the old glass with no thermal scope and all that, it'd be going back to that. Now, the reason we're talking about this is because this was mentioned by the game director for Rainbow Six Siege. Man, look how red that scope used to play. I used to play glass an absolute ton, and I used to be fine with this extraordinarily red scope. Can't believe it now I look at it. But uh, that's how it would be, which I mean. So yeah, the game director from Mr. Siege, he actually said that they've had meetings about implementing a vanilla version. And he seemed to reference two different versions. One was completely going back to the original build of the game. I don't know how that would actually be implemented. I don't know if you would, you know, there'd be a playlist, there'd be casual ranked, and then there would be the vanilla version. So is it like you you click the vanilla one and you would almost load up an entirely different game and go right back to the original build and you could play from there and it'd be like a four week event or would it be that you would have the original assets from the game but built onto the new game new games engine with the new fixes and the new edits that make it a, a better experience like higher tick rate servers and better hit registration and stuff like that that could be it. Look how far I threw that gas grenade. Man, it was so nice when they give it the impact grenade uh, throw. And there was no impact grenades as well back then. So it would be really interesting if they did do this. If they brought us a vanilla mode. And I would love it. I think it would be freaking great. And I would love to see them do it. <laughs> that guy ran right onto my nitro cell. Oh... This is the thing, when you watch this stuff back, you've got these rose tinted glasses because the game was brand new at the time. Everyone was an idiot. Like, that guy didn't even look behind him. Apparently didn't hit me as well there. But, um, yeah, it's, it is kind of like, would it really be that good? To be honest, I think the best advertisement for Rainbow would be to actually do this, to go right back to the original build, and then you could see how much better your hit registration is and stuff like that. Like, how did that guy die to my gas there? That's crazy. But yeah, there we go. That's what a vanilla mode would be and if they brought it in. And there's two different versions. They could either go full on and they'd load up a separate build of the game, the old build, or they could bring the, the original stuff back into the brand new game. So we'd still be playing with the new code, the new exploit, you know, all the exploits would be fixed. All the stuff that people could use to cheat would be fixed. And... That way you could still play the vanilla, but still have all the advantages like hit registration, better servers, which you currently have. With the current one, because if you think hit registration is bad now, go back and actually play or you know, watch old videos of this. You can see how bad hit registration actually was way back then. So for the developers, it might actually be a really good idea to go and actually say, "Here you go, play the old game," and then you realize, "Oh my god, it was such a pain in the ass to do a lot of things." Like even just this red dot site got the massive red dot in it that it doesn't have anymore it's a lot nicer now but that's it that's what we could have is this cool return to the original rainbow six and i'm all for it i think it'd be awesome now he does talk about it talk about it, the the idea of the event but it doesn't seem to have ever got past the idea of just being a meeting about this stuff so they went over a bunch of ideas and it doesn't seem to have got past the meeting stage it would be very cool if maybe they are working on it, but there's no kind of sign that they are actually working on bringing this out. It might just be a pipe dream, but you guys can let me know what you think. Would you love to have the chance, even for a four week event, to play the old game, to play the original game? No DLC operators. 
uh, you know, would you like to still have the fixes that came with all the patches we've got? Or would you like it really to just go straight back to this original build of the game with all its problems? You know, and you know, you want to play Thermit with his frag grenade, you want to play Jaeger with his, his ACOG, Bandit with his ACOG, you know, you want to bring Glass back with that stupidly red sight again. You know, do you want to try all that? Is that something you'd love to do? Because I would, certainly would. I would totally love to play this and play the original game. It would be just a hell of a lot of fun. And I don't really care how they implemented it. You know, if they implemented it with bugs or not, I think it would be really, really sweet. Anyway, guys, I think I've talked long enough on this subject. Let me know what you guys think in the comments below, and I'll catch you next time.